All right, so let's go to the history matching tab and go to FW matching. So FW is the fractional flow for water and we will do matching here. This is the FW matching for the tank because we want to do prediction, we need to perform matching for well level. So click this one well, we have well one and well two. First, we go to well one. Okay, so this is the fractional flow constructed from the historical data. This one, these data points. And before going to the prediction, we need to match these data points with this blue line. Okay. And we can easily do that by pressing this one, regress regress on default variables. All right. Okay, so we have completed the matching. So now the data points and the simulation are matched. And we need to do that also for well two. Safe regression results in well relative permeability parameters. Yes, this is the condition for well two. Regress. Okay, so now we have completed the matching, the fractional flow for well one and well two. And we can do prediction starting from now, okay? Yes, safe, safe regression results in well relative permeability parameters. Okay, it's okay for the tank, for well one already match, well two already match. Finish. Open well one. You can see now we have relative permeability parameters inputted. Residual saturation and point and the exponent. You can check the plot. A value must be entered here. Doesn't matter because we are done in this section. Okay. All right. Yeah, if you want to show the plot, you can also input the data for gas breakthrough in this section. Okay, but we can skip it for the time being. All right. So we have completed the history matching, the analytical method, right? We complete the matching by adding water influx to the reservoir model. And we also achieve very good matching for graphical methods. We generate the energy plot showing that the water influx or water drive is the dominant drive mechanism for our reservoir. And we also perform matching for well level, the fractional flow matching. And now we are ready to do prediction. So let's go to production prediction. 